I'm Rosemary Robinson. I'm Company Secretary of Arc Energy Resources, a specialist welding engineering company. Our main product is weld overlay cladding, which is an anti-corrosion application that we use in, mainly in the oil industry to prevent corrosion and wear. We also fabricators and we do work for the water industry, the nuclear industry and defence. I believe the Manufacturing Advisory Service came to us originally and just said, is there anything that we can help you with? Because of the position we were in in the recession, we knew that we needed to look at all areas of our business to make them more efficient. If you look at the history of our company, every time we have a crisis, we call in the Manufacturing Advisory Service. So we were going along quite nicely and we hit a recession. The first thing that happened was that they came along and helped us with lean manufacturing. So we reconfigured the shop floor layout. We got our teams to understand that they needed to apply the 5S strategy. We made sure that everybody had the tools they needed for the job close at hand, that they didn't have to go running around the shop looking for them. Production became more efficient and our turnover increased. Last year we had another recession. We called in Manufacturing Advisory Service. We did a management review. We looked again at how, how the board was working and how our management structure was working. And lo and behold, the company's working well again. Our sales are already increasing. So they've actually been key to every part of our business improvement as we've gone along. Having weathered the recession, we had hit a turnover of about two million and we had to make a decision, do we carry on as a small company or do we want to progress? We decided that we wanted to progress. To do this, we took on two more directors. So now we had a totally different animal in our company. We'd never managed a board before. So Simon House from Manufacturing Advisory Service came and worked through a management review with us where we looked at the roles of the board, how to turn ourselves from managers into directors of the business and also how to carry that out and, and take it down through the projects department. We reorganised the projects department and the management there and how to make sure that we were communicating and uh, everything was flowing through to the shop floor so that we could start seeing ourselves as a much more professional organisation. In addition to the operational support we've had, they've also helped us a lot with looking at new markets and our plan for growth. We've developed a, a strategy map that covers the nuclear industry, which is a big new area for us. I don't think that any manufacturer could fail to get some kind of benefit from the Manufacturing Advisory Service. Whether it's to do a big reorganisation as we have done or whether it's just support. But they've been cost effective. Everything that they've worked on us with has paid dividends. Without their support, I don't think our board would be working as well as it does. And if your board's not working, then your managers are not going to be working properly. And if your managers are not working properly, your production department's not going to be working properly. So I don't think we would have the turnover that we have at the moment. And certainly we wouldn't have the confidence that we have. They give us confidence to go forward.